Hi, in this video I will teach you new formulas uh, for expected value and variance of combination of two independent random variables. So what you need to remember uh, from the uh, section 3.3 is that for any two random variables x and y and any two constant a and b we have we have the following formulas first e of a x and number times x plus b this is another random variable and its expected value is given by a of e x plus b um, expected value of a times x plus b times y is also equal to a times expected value of x plus b times expected value of y the third property was for the variance variance of a x plus b is equal to a squared v of x as a result of this thing we we know that the standard deviation of a x plus b is also equal to a squared sorry absolute value of x if it is negative drop that times standard deviation of x itself well then question comes up question how about these guys how about e of um, for example x times y do we have any formula for this? Because that's another way of defining a new uh, random variable. How about variance of AX plus BY? We have expected value of AX plus BY. Do we have any formula for variance of AX plus BY? Well, the answer for this question is that they or there are formulas which only hold for independent random variables x and y so we will have formulas for e of x times y and v of ax plus by but only for the random variables x y which are independent let me write down the formulas so the new formulas The new formula says um, for independent random variables x and y, we have we have these two new formulas. I'll continue writing the same numbers up to three was given up there and for uh, four uh, e of x times y is equal to e x e y and v of a x plus b y is equal to a squared v x plus b squared v y well it means that yes there's formulas there are formulas these are nice formulas we can use we will use in the next example but you have to be very careful these are only true 
for the cases that x and y are independent random variables so we will use these formulas in the next videos to do more examples and find variance and expected value of xy and ax plus by and so on